Triumph have been busy launching ranges of special edition models. They started with the Street Twin Gold line early this year and followed it up by applying the Gold line treatment to the rest of the Bonneville range. Check out my video for a more detailed look at those. Now Triumph have continued this trend of special editions with three more models. The Thruxton RS Tunup, Speed Twin EC1 and the Rocket 3 221. If you want any of these models though, you'll have to pull your finger out as they're only going to be available for one year. Each one is a celebration of a different aspect of Triumph's heritage, performance and culture. Hello and welcome to Moto Chatter, let's dive into the details. The Thruxton RS Tunup Special Edition is inspired by the Tunup Boys and cafe racers of the 50s and 60s. These guys would race from cafe to cafe on their customised and modified British cafe racers. The Tunup expression refers to 100 miles per hour, and this Thruxton RS Special Edition also celebrates the first 100 mile per hour lap of the Isle of Man TT by Malcolm Uphill in 1969. In fact, the Thruxton name itself was adopted from the Racing Bonneville's victory at the Thruxton 500 race series in the hands of Mike Halewood in the late 1950s. This Thruxton Special Edition is a celebration of that racing heritage and the cafe racing subculture of the era. It comes with a unique paint scheme with a GM Blue fuel tank and jet black knee pad graphics which are bordered with hand painted silver pinstriping. The front mudguard and seat cowl are in fusion white and the mudguard has a contrasting carnival red 100 graphic and the seat cowl a carnival red infill with hand painted 100 Special Edition graphic. The side panels, headlight and rear mudguard are in jet black, the side panels having a new Thruxton RS Tunup logo, there is an optional Aegean Blue bikini fairing available as well to complement the tank's finish. The fort protectors are finished in matte aluminium silver and the wheels, engine covers and shock springs have been blacked out which helps the rest of the paint scheme to really pop. The Thruxton RS comes with the Bonneville 1200cc parallel twin engine which is capable of 103.6 horsepower at 7500 rpm and 82 pound foot of torque at 4250 rpm. It comes with a really nice looking pair of upswept silencers with a brushed finish which Triumph should really think about putting on the Speed Twin 2. You get fully adjustable 43mm shower big piston forks and fully adjustable Olin's twin shocks. Brakes are twin Brembo M50 monoblock calipers on 310mm discs with a nice and two piston caliper at the rear. Imagine this cafe racer back in the 1960s. The Thruxton RS Tunup is a machine you can really do some serious back road scratching on and as such is supplied with Metzler Racetech RR tyres. The twin dials have a traditional and classic look to them while also incorporating digital readouts to allow you all the up to date functionality that modern bikes can provide. The Thruxton RS has ABS, switchable traction control, three riding modes via the ride by wire throttle, you get a torque assist clutch, LED lights, an immobiliser and even an underseat USB charging socket. There are over 80 genuine Triumph accessories available for the Thruxton RS, allowing you to spec and customise the bike to your needs and taste. The bike and the accessories come with a two year unlimited mileage warranty too. Prices for the Ton Up Special Edition start at £14,050 in the UK. Prices for other regions are on screen now. The Street Twin EC1 Special Edition is inspired by the modern custom classics culture of London's East End, hence the EC1 name, which is the London postcode for that area of the city. It makes sense to use the Street Twin model to celebrate the modern classics custom culture as it's Triumph's best selling modern classic and since its launch in 2015 over 80% of the Street Twins sold have been customised and personalised with Triumph accessory parts by their owners from the factory. The EC1 Special comes with a two tone matte aluminium silver and matte silver ice finish to the tank with matte silver ice mud guards and side panels. It has a unique to this special edition EC1 graphics and a contrasting black Triumph logo on the tank. It has black wheels and comes with a pair of sleek, classic styled upswept silencers. The engine is the lively 900cc parallel twin Bonneville engine with peak power of 64 horsepower at 7500 rpm and 59 pound foot of torque at just 3800 rpm. The Street Twin has a single four piston Brembo caliper up front with 41mm cartridge forks and twin rear shocks which are preload adjustable. It also has a slip and assist clutch. 
The Street Twin EC1 comes with two riding modes, ABS, switchable traction control, immobilizer, and a USB charging socket under the seat. There is a huge array of 120 optional accessories available for the Street Twin and for the EC1 Special Edition. These include a matte silver ice fly screen to go with its unique paint scheme. Remember, all these Special Edition models are available for one year only. So although they are not limited in numbers, they are limited, adding an air of exclusivity into the bargain. Prices for the Street Twin EC1 start at just £9,000 in the UK. And as with other Triumph models, that includes the two-year unlimited mileage warranty. The Rocket 3R and GT221 Special Editions have been launched to celebrate the outstanding performance figures of the Rocket 3. As you may know, the Rocket 3 has the biggest capacity production engine of any motorbike you can buy today at 2,458cc. You can check out my five biggest engine production bikes video for the other big bore production bikes that are out there. And as you will see in that video, Harley Davidson do come close to the Rocket 3 in size, but the Rocket 3 is head and shoulders above when it comes to performance. 165 horsepower at 6,000 RPM and in enormous torque of 163 pound foot at 4000 rpm as you can see 163 pound foot converts to 221 newton meters hence the name of this special edition version to celebrate the rocket 3 being the unrivaled production world champion when it comes to torque the 221 Special Edition comes in this striking red hopper paint on the fuel tank and front mudguard with the black 221 knee pad graphics. The tank also details the huge numbers of the Rocket 3 such as the power, torque, engine size and the bore and stroke. But the Rocket 3 isn't just about big numbers. It's 0-60 mph time is a very small number, 2.73 seconds, which for such a big bike is astounding and makes sure that the Rocket 3 has the go to match the show and it certainly is a big show the 221 special edition is finished in sapphire black on the mudguard brackets twin headlights fly screen side panels rear bodywork and the radiator cows this lifts the red hopper tank and mudguard while at the same time contrasting well with the silver engine and side panel detailing Obviously the Rocket 3 comes in two model variants, the R and the GT, both sharing this special edition 221 paint scheme. The GT comes at a slight premium over the R, but does come with a bigger screen, adjustable pillion backrest and heated grips as standard. It has wider touring handlebars and three position adjustable forward mounted foot pegs. The GT also has a lower seat height of 750mm to the Rocket 3 R's 773mm. The Rocket 3 R has road to style handlebars and two position adjustable mid mounted foot pegs. Both the variants have the slick and tidy pillion foot pegs and the same inversely mounted monster of a triple engine. Whichever Rocket 3 you're looking at, the GT or the R, despite its size, it has a clean and lean stance with its underslung exhaust and shaft drive single sided swing arm, which helps to show off the cast aluminium 20 spoke wheels. All the Rocket 3s come with 47mm upside down shower forks and a fully adjustable shower rear monoshock. Twin Brembo Stylema monobot calipers and 320mm discs are standard up front along with a huge 300mm rear disc with its own Brembo 4 piston monoblock caliper too. Tyres are Avon Cobra chromes which were developed for the Rocket 3. You get cornering ABS cornering traction control, four rider modes including a configurable mode, hill hold control, cruise control, keyless ignition and steering lock, LED lights and the obligatory under seat USB charging socket. You can also option an up and down quick shifter and a tire pressure monitoring system as well as over 50 other optional accessories. Yes, the Rocket 3 comes with Triumph's two-year unlimited mileage warranty. Prices for the Rocket 3 R221 Special Edition start at £21,100 in the UK and for the GT221, £21,800. So there you have it, three time-limited special edition models celebrating Triumph's rich heritage, performance and custom culture. Which is your favourite? For me, 
The Street Twin EC1 blends a fresh modern paint scheme with classic looks and everyday usability. I really like the Aegean blue on the Thruxton Tunnup and the Cafe Racer style is just a pure design for me. Two wheels, a seat and an engine. The Rocket 3 though gets my vote overall. The 221 Special Edition is a striking yet simple paint scheme and I already hold the Rocket 3 as one of my favourite ever bikes. I don't think I would keep the power, torque and engine figures on the tank though. The look of the Rocket 3 speaks for itself without having to spell it out. But those are my thoughts, what do you think? Let me know in the comments. I hope you enjoyed the video, if you did go ahead and give it a thumbs up, it helps the channel and is always really appreciated. Remember to subscribe for plenty more motorcycle videos to come click the links on screen for more now and that biggest engine production bikes video i mentioned but whatever you do have a great day and thanks for watching